Hey, boy, why you look so sad? Is there something wrong with you? Yeah, I'm so upset because of this COVID-19 and I'm bored staying here at home. I couldn't even go to school and meet my classmates. Just last night, we received a very sad news that my Uncle John got sick because of COVID and my two little cousins are COVID What? positive. So how can I rejoice at this moment? I have a joy, 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 joy down in my heart. Where? Down in my heart. Hey, Baba, why are you so happy? And it seems you are not affected of our situation today. Are you not sad that we cannot go to school and meet our classmates because of this COVID-19? Of course not! Why? Because God told us to rejoice at all times. Have you ever heard the Bible story of two persons who rejoiced even though they were put into prison? No, I haven't heard that story yet. Ooh, ooh, Baba, can you please share it with us? Sure! There were two men named Paul and Silas who were accused of causing trouble in the city while proclaiming the salvation from the one true God. The soldiers whip them with rod and throw them in prison. The jailer made sure they could not escape. He put Paul and Silas in the dungeon of the prison, locked their feet between two pieces of wood called stocks, and chained the wrist to the wall. Paul and Silas suffered. They were bruised and bleeding in the dark and unable to stand up and stretch. But God was with them. So, they began to pray and sing praises to God despite of their situation. And other prisoners listened. At about midnight, something happened. There was a strong earthquake, and the entire prison shook so much, and the door opened and every chain fell off. Paul and Silas had the opportunity to run away, but they didn't. Instead, they shared Jesus to the jailer, and his whole family got saved. Wow! Paul and Silas didn't complain with their situation. Yeah, but instead, they choose to rejoice despite they were imprisoned. Yes, you're right, Goki. Hmm, I should not have complained earlier about school or what happened to my family. True! Jesus gives us a wonderful life when He carry our greatest problem on the cross, the problem of sin. Do you remember the jailer in the story? He wanted to die because he was hopeless. He thought Paul and Silas escaped. But when Paul shared to him the good news on how Jesus loves him by dying for all his sins, He started to have hope, and he made a personal decision to believe on the Lord Jesus. Have you ever made that decision to believe in Jesus, Goki and Poyi? Mm -hmm. Then talk to Jesus now. Jesus, thank you so much for dying on the cross for my sins. I'm sorry for all my sins. Please come into my heart. I receive you as my Lord and Savior. Amen. Thank you so much for sharing to us about what Jesus did for us. You're welcome, Goki. Remember, Jesus lives already in you no matter what happens. 
be a Swazian even in this COVID situation. Oh, oh, I have to share this to my family. Wow, I am so happy because I already have Jesus. Let's go, Goki. Let's share this good news. Boy, wait. Here comes our friends. Oh, hi, Ching Ching. Hi, Kipo. Come on, I'm going to share something wonderful. It's about Jesus. I'm going to tell you about him on our way home. Come, come, come.